Hey there, do you love broccoli cheddar soup, but you're trying to give up dairy for health reasons? If so, you're going to love today's recipe. We are making a dairy-free but creamy roasted broccoli soup. So let's get started. So surprise, surprise, we are starting with sauteed onions and garlic. We always start with that for our soup. Onions and garlic are both great for the immune system. And then we are also adding some chopped celery and broccoli stalks. And you definitely want to use the stalks. I know that everyone's all about the broccoli crowns, but the stalks are great for a soup. So that's what we're using today. So I like to think of broccoli as the original superhero of antioxidants because this food is so powerful. It's an anti-inflammatory superhero. And broccoli is just an amazing vegetable that ideally you would incorporate into your diet a couple, three times a week. So now that the vegetables have softened up a little bit, we are going to add our liquid. So we're adding low sodium vegetable broth. And now for the dairy-free creamy part of things, we are adding just regular raw unsalted cashews. And then we are also adding some tahini, about a tablespoon. So this is made from ground sesame seeds, high in calcium, and this will provide that creaminess and some healthy fat. So what really makes this soup is I pre-roasted some of the broccoli florets, and I just pre-roasted them with a little bit of avocado oil, salt and pepper, uh, but this gives the soup a really nice nutty flavor. And you could skip this, you could just add raw broccoli if you wanted to, but if you have the time, this is a really nice way to really bump up the flavor on the soup. So we will give everything a stir. We will bring this up to a boil and then let it simmer until the vegetables are tender. So once the vegetables are tender, then you wanna let the mixture cool off a little bit and transfer it to your blender or use an immersion blender and then maybe have to blend in batches until you have the consistency that you want. A really nice, creamy, smooth consistency. And when you blend, you are going to want to add some nutritional yeast. You can find this in the bulk aisle. And this is the ingredient that will give it that nice cheesy flavor. People use it on popcorn, they use it in salad dressings, sauces. This is a great ingredient. It's also a good source of vitamin B. So that's our nutritional yeast. And then you'll also want to blend your soup with a little bit of lemon juice just to brighten up the flavor. So once you've blended, this is what your soup will look like. It's creamy, it has a nice smooth consistency. You might save some of your little broccoli florets for a little garnish. Or if you have some vegan sour cream or something like that, cashew cream, that would be a nice garnish as well. So this is our dairy-free roasted broccoli soup, and the recipe is waiting for you over at monicametz.com forward slash more GDO. I hope you enjoy it.